So what would you consider to be the biggest challenges facing developers today? And how do you address them in your work? To Very really clearly, it, as mentioned, it, it is cost construction. That, that's probably one of the, the most, uh, I guess, challenging risks right now for any property developer mm-hmm. in any sector. Um, but, you know, as mentioned, there, there's buildings coming up all the time. There's, there's, uh, there's supply and there's demand. Um, if you understand the, the rental vacancy throughout Australia right now, it's super tight. So there is not enough uh, property for people to rent. So if you just go to any inspection for rentals on a weekend, um, you probably see anywhere from 10 to 20 couples lighting up for the same property. That, that's telling me how the demand is at the moment. So that's a good problem for a developer. There's strong demand. So that's it's unmentioned, you know, it's a good foundation for a developer to give them confidence to build. So the next, obviously, is trying to find the right product, right locations. Um, so uh, that, that's the key for the right developer um, to solve. Um, so, yeah, I think... Uh, do risking construction costs. Um, ways that we've been doing it these days are one, factoring in, I guess, uh, more a, uh, a contingency. So most standard developers or lenders they'll look at 5% as a project contingency, um, as a buffer. Nowadays, we've been shifting that to maybe some cases 7.5%, sometimes even up to 10% as a uh, standard requirement uh, in wow. the funding table. So it's, we've increased the contingency. So uh, we've seen that required a lot more, obviously. Um, so the second thing we've been able to do is actually plan a longer term. So ideally, most people might have a 12-month build plan. Maybe now it's a 15-month build plan. So uh, very rare have we seen the last year or two projects build under time. Uh, most cases we've seen is delays. Uh, I haven't seen many build right on time what was yep. planned. Mm. Most are being delayed. We're continuously finding ways to a solved solution at the end of the product. It, it's running out of time, needs more term. So uh, factoring a longer build time is, is um, uh, advised. Mm. Um, and lastly, probably um, uh, find a buffer. So most of us may may not have a, a project buffer. Um, so if you didn't, definitely highly recommend have a project buffer. Mm. And whatever that buffer is, increase it again. So you know, what are we saying? We're saying plan for high costs plan for longer build time, uh, longer sediment time, so your end buyer might need more time with their financiers um, and have a project buffer and whatever that is, increase that again. So mm. just be more cautious than ever. Um, mm. So there's still great projects, profit margins. It's got to plan appropriately. 